You go out and you fight. Tatake. Hello, fellow Yigurists. Tatake. If you're not a Yigurist, if you don't know what that means, that's okay. But I wanted to make this follow-up video for all my new subscribers who are Yigurists. I want to follow up on what I said at the end of my live stream last week. We can still take the lessons that Chadron imparted upon us. If we win, we live. We lose, we die. The only way to win is to fight. Improve your life. Make yourself better. Make yourself the best you can be. We will keep fighting. We will fight forever. Fighting, but winning. And so today I'm gonna to show you a little of what I do to Tatake, my Tatake workout plan. We can all always be better. Right, Anne? Absolutely, Greg. <laughs> okay. There's not a lot of things in life that you can control. One thing you can control is yourself. And that is your mental sharpness and your physical sharpness. And those are interconnected. If you want to win, what do you have to do, Anne? Tatake. Okay. <laughs> That's right. You have to fight. And so you have to push yourself to be the best that you can be. I just, it just sounds so generic. If you have looked back on the channel, you may have seen that a month before I was supposed to be married, I was dumped by my girlfriend who I was going out with for seven years. I had no job with no prospects for the future. I was truly at the bottom of my life. Now, this is not a sob story. This is not to say, wow, look how good I am or anything like that. But this is only to say that no matter where you are, in fact, the closer you are to the bottom, the better it is for you to tatake. You can begin to turn it around no matter where you are at. And so we're here out at the beach. Take a quick look in, please. Isn't that lovely? Now you may not have a beach to be able to run at. This is something you could do as long as you have a park nearby and land. That's all you need. So the first step of what we're gonna do is we are going to run approximately a little over a mile, it's about 1.2 miles, but I would suggest one mile. Anne's gonna get on the bike, come on, Anne. The harder you can push yourself, the better. Come on, Anne. That's step one. We ran a little over a mile. A mile is fine. We are here at Santa Monica Muscle Beach, which is, which is the original Muscle Beach. But you can do this at a park. Once we've reached our mile, we're going to work out. And one of the things we're gonna do is 100 push-ups. We're not gonna do them all in a row. We're gonna do them in chunks. I like to do them here on the bars because it allows you to go lower, but you can do them on the ground. The point is, is that now that we're tired, we're gonna continue push through. That's 40 push-ups off the bat. I like to take a huge chunk out in the beginning, but you can do it any way you want. You just gotta get to 100. We'll come back to push-ups. But now we're gonna rotate. With those, we're gonna do 40 total, four sets of 10. 20 of pull-ups, it's this way. 20 of chin-ups, it's this way. Those are not easy to do. If you can't do all that, that's okay. You can do as much as you can. With pull-ups, all you need is a bar. If you go to a park and there's monkey bars, that will work. You wanna keep your elbows at a right angle. That's how far down you wanna go. Those are dips, they focus on the tricep here. They're really, it's really just a cosmetic exercise, who cares? So we're only gonna do about 20 of those. Some people who want to work out but find it hard to find the motivation to go and do it, ask me, how do I stay motivated? It's very simple. You have to find a fire that burns within you and if you can find it, then nothing will stop you. It could even be like if you were in school and your teacher told you you would never amount to anything. F you. That's the attitude you gotta have. It, it could be anybody who's ever said anything about you, a bully who's ever made fun of you. The way you get back at them is while their fat ass is getting fatter, you go out and you fight. Tatake. What Greg is saying is right. I too have gotten in amazing shape and it was usually because of a breakup that had gone wrong. Just imagine you were bullied in school. 
and you were the little guy, but all of a sudden, you're 40 years old and you're in great shape. And that guy who used to bully you is now overweight, sad with his life, and a drunk. Who wins? Who won? That's what this is all about. Do it for yourself, but also do it to stick it up their ass. In an unsexual way, of course. That's what I mean, you know it. This is very much like the One Punch Man workout, if you know of One Punch Man. With some slight modifications, squats, and does those. They're a little hard on the knees, so be careful. You can add those in. That is a part of One Punch Man's workout. But other than that, you also want to do abs, basically, until it hurts so much you can't do it anymore. And if you think you can't do this, just know that Anne does half of what I do. Does it hurt? Yes. <laughs> so if she does it, you can do it. Right, Anne? Hey! I'm just kidding, of course. Anne is very strong. A little at a time. It may not, after one time, you may not see results, but a little at a time, one month later, you say, hey, this is working. And then you keep going, and you fight, and you tatake, and eventually, you'll find yourself in a place you never thought you could be before. Before we leave, as a bonus, we're gonna watch Anne go up the rope. Go ahead. Yep. <laughs> Is that it? Go ahead, one more try. Oh, I'm gonna get a shot from the top. Oh, All right, Greg. <laughs> Very nice. Obviously, you won't be able to do that at your park. But once you're done with everything else, the last step is to take that mile that you ran here and run it back. I know, it's the hardest part, but it must be done. And then, of course, once you make it back, I highly recommend finishing it all off with some whey protein. So that's it, that's my Tataka A workout. Of course, you can take any element of it that you like and apply it to your own life. I hope this video wasn't too preachy or sappy. You should be hyped in this video. Let's go, let's go get it, let's win, let's fight. More than anything, remember that we keep moving forward until the day we destroy our enemies. Fight. Nothing could stop us. All right, yes. Let's go work out. Woohoo! I suppose it's important to stay in shape. <laughs>